Nobody understands how the f algorithms work. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna debunk the algorithms on social media and we're gonna start getting real. Hey, it's Nick from Spark. Today, we're gonna dive deep into the world of algorithms and we're gonna try to truly find out how these really work. So don't zone out just yet. We're gonna try to make this simple and fun so we can all gain a little bit of value. So I've been doing this for the last 10 years and I still don't really understand how these algorithms work. They're changing all the time. So what we're gonna do today is we're gonna dive deep into the world of algorithms and hopefully you can gain some value out of how these things truly work to best optimize your content. So first things first, anytime you hear the word algorithm, just replace it with audience. Algorithm sounds all scientific and and really when you replace it with audience, that's truly who you're trying to communicate with anyway. So think of it like this. You're out at a party and you're telling a story to a group of people. Some people lean in and they're very interested while others wander off to the snack table. This is your audience giving you signals. Think of your social platforms and the content that you're putting out just like that giant party. Every like, share, comment, or your social reactions. These are your audience signals and you have to be able to hold their attention. So don't think about algorithm, think about audience. But of course, there's a catch. Not all audience signals are created equal. Just like that person who's standing in the corner at the party talking about their cat, go have fun engaging with them because nobody else is gonna wanna do it. So if you think about it, comments are going to weigh a little bit more than a quick like. And so these are the sort of things that you're gonna try to get out of your content whenever you're posting it. How do you win at this party? It's simple, be deliberate, focus on your audience. Focus on trying to make genuine connections with the content that you're putting out and drive value. That's what's going to make the audience come back and engage with your content. So one thing to remember, every time you put something out, ask yourself a question. Are you actually driving value to the people on the other side consuming your content? Is it something that's shareable? Whether you get a positive or a negative comment, every action needs a signal. So in the end, it's not about tricking the algorithm. It's about focusing on the audience. Make sure when you're putting out content that you're truly providing value to your end user, because that's what's gonna keep them coming back. So next time you go out and you're trying to put out good content, really focus on that. Focus on the audience and focus on truly creating engagements. So stop thinking about the algorithm and focus on audience. This is gonna truly make your life a lot easier and I hope that you gain value from this. So if you found value in this conversation, make sure you like and subscribe.